wouldn't it be something if the church had more servants? Amen. Come on, man. Amen. Wouldn't it be something, Pastor Daniel? Wouldn't it be something that all of your members, you, you go to list and every week somebody's going to sign up to clean the church bathrooms? Amen, amen, amen. Wouldn't it be something? Wouldn't it be something, husband, wife, kid? You, you assign the restroom. What James is showing us is the necessity for humility. Uh huh. James has no pride. James, the key point is James knows clearly who he's serving. He is serving. He is serving God. And I just got a question for you. How do you want to be remembered? Mm -hmm. You guys know I teach counseling, and one of the things that the students have to do is they have to write their own eulogy. Ooh. What would you put? I know you guys have all, you're smarter than I, you have already got your plots, you've got all this, but if you had to write it yourself, what do you want to be remembered by? James doesn't say, I'm a disciple, I am, I'm Holy Ghost. So James says, no, I'm a servant. He says, I'm a servant. And, and notice, notice this, he says, I want to be remembered by not only that I'm a servant, but how would my family and my friends and my coworkers, how would they describe you? Yeah, yeah. Talk to me, somebody. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you. So how would, if, if, if I were to anonymously give the individual sitting next to you to describe how they would remember you, what would they 